Before we start the reaction video, always remember to support the original content creator by using the links in the description below. Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Axel Grape coming at you with more reactions with an X. And today we are going to finish off Ruby Volume 5 with Episode 14, Haven's Fate. It is a bit of a doozy with the 24 minutes. I know that's because it's going to have the credits and everything, which we will leave in there. Got to show support and love to Rooster Teeth. Speaking of, check the links below where you can find information on how to do that. You can also show us some love by liking, commenting, or subscribing below. Or you can hit us with a compliment or a critique. Uh, you know, uh, constructive criticism always being the best. Uh, you know, you can support us even more by checking out the patreon you'll see we have our little logo and other stuff when we film but uh for now we're going to get into it we really like talking with you so if you want to chat with us in our discord or on patreon or whatever all the links are below uh you can cut to chat in the youtube comments and we'll try to get back to you as well but yeah no more ado this is like almost a 25 minute video so we're gonna go ahead and get right into it three two one yeah sorry i had to make sure that all that was going good and this one we will watch through the intro because it's the end of the season, so we won't have any more spoilers. Right? We shouldn't. Watch it still have spoilers. I'd be mad. See, like, there it shows around the, sh the thing. So I'm going to see what spoilers would have been given. Rooster Teeth animation. Uh, nothing yet. That's cool, though. Uh, that would have given you a little bit, but I think they, we already kind of knew that they were... No. Yeah. There's a lot. There's a lot of, like, ties and stuff to it where it's like, now nah, these guys are working with these guys. They're in... Although you couldn't necessarily tell that that would have fawned us thing. You knew that they were going to meet. Yeah. We, and I knew she was the Spring Maiden because I accidentally saw a part of this first thing. Would have gotten a little more with her in that. So it wasn't that many. Okay, that's what can happen here. The shoe can drop. Salem can show up. That's. I was like, there's got to be a shoe that another shoe that's gonna drop to give tension to the next season. Cause right now they're just not in the best place. We just had Cinderfall. Um, it looks like most of these guys are just in trouble. They look outnumbered and outmatched. That is still an interesting weapon for her. I'm going to make you regret ever coming back. More police are on their way, Adam. Huntsman too. Don't you afraid to face me on your own? I'm here for Haven, not you. You are still afraid. And you should be. I've made powerful friends while you've been away. Oh, yeah? Where? Tell me, does Blake make all of her classmates fight for her? Nah, it's a volunteer gig. I'm just saying, if someone who claims to have such great friends doesn't seem to be anything they're willing to fight for you. Ooh. Man, how strong is Adam? Can he take on all these people? Ooh, she is over you. Two on one. Right, but he's... Once again, he is not the most important thing. She is smart now. See the growth? The growth is, am is amazing. Watching these characters grow is amazing. Okay. 
I'm just waiting for the shoe to drop. I'll say, so far, this guy is probably... Oh, I forgot Lionheart's still her fighting, too. And these two. So he's not alone fighting, but it feels like he's alone fighting. combo moves. That's one other thing Ruby had did that I wish they had pushed more effort into in the farther seasons was the further production of those. He probably killed her. So you killed her. Nobody cares. Like literally nobody cares about your struggle. You guys too, me too. Nobody cares about your struggle. Why should they? Probably. Yeah, she's weak at heart, right? Fear, cowardice, not willing to stand up to Salem. Yeah. Which might not be a smart thing, but once again, is the brave and strong thing to do. Because she's not a coward.
That was the thing before. The only thing about her plan that didn't make sense is like, I don't want her to chase us, so I'm going to use the object to keep her away. And now she doesn't want the object, so. One of those two points she had a critical flaw in thinking. They can't both be right, right? She either didn't think of it before or didn't care before. She's still one of the most prudent characters, and I respect her a great deal for once again doing what needed to be done. But this doesn't make her a brave character. She's strong, but that there's strong, physically strong in fights, strong in character. I don't think she's strong in character. It's an interesting item. It looks like genie lamp of some kind. This is gonna be a long episode, isn't it? Or no, it's, uh, uh, what is it that they swing and burn the incense in? Or a lantern, I guess, maybe. I like how everything in that world is just kind of like... <laughs> Poor girl. This guy has got a totally contrary name. I know that's the joke, right? Professor Lionheart's a coward. Salem? Ah, uh, the, the ball. Once again, uses and abuses them. Well, uses them and throws them away. So that's what I expect here is for Salem to kill him, because he's of no use to her anyway. Not at this point. That was it, huh? Said, see, you can do it without it being on screen. Yes, you will. You bet on the wrong horse, or maybe the right one, but hey. Mm. Sorry about that, guys. I need a drink. I've been here filming for like two hours. See, I like how they make characters real with real character motivations, right? She follows Cinder not because she's evil, but because she owes Cinder her life. Dude hates Ozpin because of his little sister. That's why he works with him. An illusion? So she powered up. That or it really was, yeah. Okay.
I guess no more shoes are dropping. They're just using it as a wrap-up time. Sorry. Yay! Not yay. Yep, be safe, guys. <laughs> That's cute. This will be emotional. Some of the coolest parts about this season was that it wasn't about Ruby herself, but it was about Yang and Blake and Weiss. So cute. That's adorable. They deserve that. They work hard. Yeah, you are not in a safe space right now, and it's no longer protected by the maiden lock thing. All right, there it was. Now we got the credits to talk about it. This is an interesting one. It's going to be interesting to see. And I was wondering if they were going to do that. Because they usually do that with Ruby's. You'll have like an upbeat uh, season. And then you'll have a down season. Where it is like more like the way villains win at the end. Kind of like the series where season where Paradise. I can't remember which season. Um, but I didn't know if they were going to go dark tense or light tense on this one. So next time we're going to Atlas. We're slowly exploring the different continents. Obviously, last time, uh, the original one, we had... Mm, God, I can't remember them all. Sorry, I got, you guys got to remember. I, I'm into so many different manga and anime and shows and universes that keeping track of every name of every city and state and person becomes ridiculously complicated. Um, having said that, like you said, we, we've checked out uh, a couple different countries. Atlas is one where we really haven't seen as in-depth... As we have in some of these others. Oh, not all of them either, but you know, obviously, Mistral, we got to see a larger section of it than we've gotten to see of Atlas. We only really saw some of like Atlas through Weiss's eyes, I think, which we've seen some, but just not a very large section. Like Mistral, we were at the banding camp in Haven, traveling through the, the country to get to Haven. Uh, Haven itself, you know what I mean, is 
it got even several places nearby it or under you know what i mean there was a lot going on there that we got to build the world which is great i love world building it's like my favorite thing and there's gonna be a lot of animators on this i just know it oh man recording engineers re-recording mix engineers always so many people that go uh vo audio there is actually that's what people forget is there's so many specifics so like i'm a specialist in vocal audio right and then after that i do uh mixing and mastering of uh like productions and stuff that's my special skill is the mixing and mastering section of production not necessarily the recording section of production which i can do and i'm decent at but that's not my specialty I'm usually the guy on the second end that once you've recorded vocals and everything down, you send it, I mix down everything and or master your mix that you've got to sound you right so it sounds well for the radio, which people are like, well, why doesn't your stuff always sound good? Because these are not my mix and audio, audio master stuff. These get recorded, put into a program and uploaded. <laughs> so if it didn't come in well on the recording section, that's why it's messed up. Uh, also, we're using like OBS. We've got a nice mic, but that can oftentimes be less or more good like a shitty mic a really shitty mic's not too bad but a really good mic can also be really finicky like you might have to be careful with it so you don't blow out for example right like ribbons are really fun nice mics because they're specialty sound but you have to be really del delicate with a ribbon because even a loud enough noise can tear the ribbon part of the ribbon mic uh, oh man oh wow look at all these musics mirror mirror pat part 0.5 smile ignite the triumph said so there's always so much music that i think after we finish ruby we'll just have to go through and do music video lyric reactions to these because people love these the uh, own family double gold members first members rt community ruby combat ready packers like you see all the people that help make this stuff happen people's families dylan luna that's uh miles is people uh, Miles did some really good voice acting for John in this season. I feel like it was really good. Um, it's funny because I was just saying that about Bernie for another part of like Red vs. Blue I was watching earlier today or the other day. Where he's the little ball and he's just like, Washington! And he did really good there. Security. Snoop the Rat. Totoro. A, and we're assuming there's going to be some after stuff after the credits. There's also going to be some advertisements for the Ruby animated stuff after this, which we may or may not throw on. I guess it just depends. And as always, guys, uh, I people are constantly like, oh, well, you know, the, why do you have them edited? Ruby keeps taking my stuff down. They won't. They've decided to keep taking it down. I've tried disputing. Sometimes it goes due. Sometimes it doesn't. Hey, back here. Oh. Why? Just to... That's interesting. A little shot to show that she went back to the dead. Oh, and here's all the other Rooster Teeth animation stuff. I do remember seeing this. I, I've actually seen a couple episodes of, yeah, Nomad of Nowhere. Or To Nowhere? No, Of Nowhere. It was interesting. I saw a couple episodes. It was uh, something. And then they probably have like Camp Cab or something. What else do we got here? I don't know how I've never seen this one. Genlock. I did hear about Genlock. I just didn't hear much about it i don't know anything about it i didn't hear anything so maybe it did really good maybe it didn't it only came out in 2018 it looks like so it's not like it's been around all that long two years but still
Thanks everyone for watching another episode of Reactions with an X with me, your host Axel Grave. I appreciate every single view and every single comment on these videos. If you enjoyed the video, remember to hit like to show your support and hit subscribe to see more reaction videos. If you like the other content we do on the channel, remember to hit the little bell and press all to see all of our videos. Finally, if you wanted to leave us a comment or a suggestion on other material we to do, or just to rip us to shreds, leave a note in the comments and we'll try to get back to you.